Motorists are reminded to watch for deer along roadways this time of year, especially at dawn and dusk when deer are most active. We can have deer uh, vehicle collisions throughout the year, but the majority of our deer vehicle collisions are going to be in the fall months, October, November. That's typically when we have our peak deer movement in the state. There are several reasons you will see more deer moving across the landscape at this time of year. The breeding season is starting, and, and of course, uh, you know, bucks are constantly in search of does. Uh, the other thing is, you know, oftentimes deer will have different summering areas from wintering areas and they're dispersing to different areas. And when our upland bird seasons open up, there's just people walking and just about every bit of cover almost on a daily basis. And, and that disperses deer along with just uh, farming activities throughout the state, uh, people enjoying the fall. Eglin has a few tips if you happen to see a deer on the road or in the ditch. Number one, you know, probably want to slow down a little bit at night. If you see a deer, slow down, hit the brakes, and still maintain control of the car. Do not swerve. Oftentimes when you see one deer, be on the lookout for other deer in the ditch. Particularly if there's a buck chasing a doe or the doe is still have pawns with them. There are known areas where deer cross the road and some are in high risk areas marked with deer crossing signs. You know, anytime you have uh, areas where there's habitat adjacent to food, uh, deer certainly can be crossing. Uh, river corridors or natural travel, travel corridors. This is Mike Anderson in the North Dakota Outdoors.